In this video, we are going to see about Standard 2, Environmental Science, Term 2, Lesson 1, Food and Health. Cereals and Pulses Let's see about cereals. A cereal is any grass cultivated for an edible component of its grains composed of an endosperm, germ and a bran. The term may also refer to the resulting grain itself. Meanings Edible Fit to be eaten Endosperm A tissue inside seed Germ A microorganisms Bran A heart Outer layer of a cereal grain Cereals We have a lots of cereals which we include in a daily life as a food, as a snack, as a healthy ingredient. Wheat Rice Barley Corn Oats and millet. Pulses. A legume is a plant or a fruit or seed. The seed is also called as a pulse. Legumes are grown agriculturally primarily for human consumption. Pulses. Few of them are cow peas, we call it as karamani, red kidney beans, sivapu karamani, double beans, irate beans, peas, patani. Oil, we get oil from seeds and nuts. We use oil for cooking. Few oils which we are using for cooking are coconut oil, groundnut oil, sunflower oil and sesame oil. The sunflower oil we get from the sunflower seeds. Coconut oil we get from coconut. Groundnut oil we get from peanuts. The sesame oil we get from sesame seeds. So we get oil from different kinds of nuts and seeds coffee and tea we like to have coffee and tea at least twice a day from where do we get this coffee and tea we get coffee from coffee beans and tea from tea leaves by drinking coffee and tea it helps us to protect our brain and nerve attacks jaggery and sugar this jaggery and sugar are used to add flavor as a sweet in a daily food we use sugar and jaggery even in tea and coffee and making different kinds of sweets we get jaggery from palm tree we call it as Panay Maram and we get different kinds of jaggeries, palm jaggery and palm sugar. We call palm jaggery as karpati vellam and palm sugar as panangkande. Sugar cane, we used to call it as karbu. We get jaggery, the regular vellam which we use and sugar, we used to call it as sarkarai. These jaggery and sugar are used to add sweets in a daily food items. Spices Spices are very important which add in a daily food which gives us flavor and taste. So the plants also give us spices. So different kinds of spices which we use in a daily life are curry leaves, we call it as karvepalai, turmeric, manjal, 
சில்லிஸ் மிளகாய் சினமோன் பட்டை ஃபெனுகிரிக் வெந்தயம் மஸ்டர்ட் கடுகு க்ளோவ் லவங்கம் கியூமின் சீரகம் தே ஆர் ஆல் ஆல்சோ ஹேவ் மெடிசினல் வேல்யூஸ் அண்ட் தே ஹெல்ப் அஸ் இன் டைஜிஷன் ஸ்கின் ஃபேஸ் அண்ட் ஹேர் அண்ட் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் கைண்ட்ஸ் ஆஃப் மெடிசினல் வேல்யூஸ் இட் ஹெல்ப்ஸ் இன் அ டெய்லி லைஃப் vegetables fruits and greens we include lots of vegetables fruits and greens in a daily life as they have so many medicinal values in them they are also low in fat salt and sugar vegetables fruits and greens are a good source of dietary fiber healthy food versus junk food a good nutrition or a healthy food is always necessary for a healthy life with healthy food and diet we can promote a life healthy why we need a healthy diet children we need to take a balanced food in a daily life which has a main components like carbohydrate fats and protein with more than this in the food which gives us energy is in carbohydrate then the one third is in fat and the 15% of energy is in protein when compared to this 35% of a healthy food is in carbohydrates the rest 25% is in fruits and in vegetables and 20% is in fat and 15 to 80% it is in protein and the last 2 to 5% is in sugar all these things together will form a healthy diet which we have to have in a proper proportion in our daily life we need to take not only vegetables and fruits but also we need to include nuts egg milk all kinds of food in a daily diet this is food pyramid so the picture shows us how the food has to taken in a daily life in a proper proportion the healthy food we have the healthy food we live so few healthy foods which we have to follow in a daily life as a food pyramid are pastry vegetables fruits egg milk products fish and meat we need to take meat and fish regularly but not as like vegetables and fruits we have to take it it and it in a limited quantity because we used to say that honey is also good for health but too much of anything is always good for nothing more honey is also makes us poisonous what is junk food yes whatever food we have in a daily life which has a poor nutrition value we'll call it as junk food the junk foods are unhealthy for our body the junk food has fat sodium sugar which gives us a health very worst the junk food is also easy to carry purchase and consume but when compared with an healthy food it is not very good for our health we get junk food the reasons because it is attractive in its appearance the colors the flavor and the texture the taste all these things will make us more attractive towards the junk food few junk foods which we have in a daily life is pizza burger ice cream chocolate chips french fries 
cool drinks and cakes why junk foods are so attractive because it is very simple and it is very easy to prepare and it's look very tasty the junk foods such as potato wafers do not even have a nutrition value as it has in a baked potato the junk foods have only taste and attractiveness but not health by having this junk food we will get a lots of health problems like obesity that is overweight lack of energy we feel very energyless poor concentration we can't do any work perfectly high blood pressure bp heart diseases like breathing cardiovascular diseases and diabetes like heart problems and sugars let us compare healthy food and junk food the healthy food are always very simple and makes the people healthy but if we take a little quantity of junk food there is no nutritional value and it makes our health worse